Ethel, you've done something wonderful in that she has made all these quilts for someone who is involved with hospice. And I know it's thrilled all the men and women that you've been able to present to these beautiful quilts. And it's my honor to present to you today uh, this award. I just love to sew. <laughs> it's, and this is one way I can make a difference, I guess. Ethel's quilts are delivered to our patients and families throughout Green Country, Oklahoma. Since I've been here in five months, I bet I've seen 40 or 50 quilts come through here. When I first started out, I just made a quilt. And I just got started that way and just kept on. Patients are touched. It, it really means a lot to them because they're, they're, they're struggling in their life. They're, they're in a, a time of their life that uh, most people don't look forward to. But when we told her the award, she was excited about it, but she also felt somewhat uncomfortable because she doesn't like to be in the limelight. It's an honor, and I'm glad to get it, but I'm sure that there's other people that deserves it more than I do. When you uh, try to say thank you, she just shrugs it off because she believes that's what she should be doing. I just don't like to be in the spotlight. <laughs> She's always so giving and we're, we're very much inspired by her.